guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am coming to you with my current favourites from the past month of June because we're about to go into July. I know I said I wasn't going to do these every single month but I've been loving too many products at the moment that I had to share them with you guys. Before I get into the favourites though, I have an idea that I want to put to you guys. So recently I stumbled across my vlogging camera. If you guys don't know, I do have a vlogging channel aside from this one but I haven't used it in like a year and because I stumbled across this vlogging camera I really thought to myself that I wanted to get back into vlogging but since I'm not really so active on that channel I was thinking of starting up a series on this channel with the same name as that channel if that makes sense so it's like a series on this channel and I wanted to call it Life with Lizelle which is the name of my other channel um, but yeah I wanted to call it that and basically it would just be weekly vlogs but I don't know if you guys would be interested to see that from me because like you all know this is a beauty channel and I don't know if you guys are interested to see my personal daily life if you guys are interested let me know I wouldn't be doing daily vlogs like uploading vlogs daily I'd just be doing weekly vlogs, so basically vlogging for a week, smashing the footage together and making a weekly vlog for you all. So my idea is to have at least two videos a week, so I would have a beauty video and a vlog video, fingers crossed hopefully, um, but I'm not exactly sure if you guys would be interested in seeing vlogs from me because as you know this is a beauty channel and that's what most of you would have subscribed for, so if you are interested in that and you like the idea then tell me and I'll look into doing that because I I want to start vlogging again but I wasn't sure if I wanted to just keep it on the channel that it's on or integrate it into this channel so I, I need your guys input at the end of the day like I do upload videos for you guys so if you are interested in seeing that let me know alright with that being said I'm going to get into my current favorites if you are interested to see what I have been obsessed with this past month then just keep on watching so the first thing that I have to show you guys is this body butter by Dirty Works. It's the Supreme Cream Body Butter and I picked this up from Target for only $9.00. I think it was on sale and I only picked it up because I was in need of a new body butter and I just saw this so I picked it up. I didn't think I would like it but I'm really obsessed with the scent. It smells so nice and clean. It's actually quite thick but it settles into the skin really nicely and I do like to have thick body butters especially because we're currently in winter over here so this has been awesome I really like the scent it has shea butter and sweet almond oil so if you're interested in this you can pick this up from Target or Kohl's I recently did a massive clean of all my makeup brushes and sponges and I used this this is from Daiso it's the detergent for puff and sponge it says everything else is in um, Japanese writing I think it is but this stuff is amazing. It cleans brushes like no other. The time that it takes to, for me to clean my brushes is less than it would be for a normal soap or detergent that I would use. And I really like this because it does get stains out as well. Past brush cleaners that I have used get the product out but it leaves a stain. But this gets every single stain out and it makes your brushes look like you just bought them. So you can get this from Daiso. It's only $2.80. As you guys may be aware, I am an avid user of gel nail polishes. I love to do them at home by myself, and I've really been liking the Sally Hansen brand of them. So the color that I'm currently wearing is Pink Pong. It's this one here. On my nails, it turns out to be a really nice, like, new kind of pink shade. The other color that I have been obsessing over for the winter months is Red Zin. It's this really pretty maroon, deep red kind of berry shade, and I really like this brand because it takes only 30 seconds for them to cure. Previous brands that I have used take about two, two and a half minutes to cure, but these only take 30 seconds, so it cuts the time that it takes me to do my nails in half, and I really like them. So if you're interested in some Sally Hansen gel nail polishes, go and check out Priceline because they do stock them and they're always having sales on them. For the past month, I have been trying to make my eyelashes longer. I know it sounds a little bit weird, but this has been really working for that, so I think I might do a video on that in the future. But I've really been liking vitamin E oil. As you know, I love vitamin E oil. I use it for many things, especially for um, like pimples and blemishes and things like that. It really helps to 
diminish them or reduce the look of them but I've also been using this on my lashes and it has really helped to grow them so I really been obsessed with vitamin E oil for the past month. This brush is my absolute new favorite brush. It is the Models Prefer Contour Brush and I love it. I have been using it every single day and I'm so glad I picked it up. You can get it from Priceline. I think it's $19 or $18. Super good. I can't say enough good things about this. If you are looking for a dupe for the Nars, Nars, Nars Ida brush or ITA brush, go and check this out. Um, it's amazing. So I love to use this for my cheekbones, under my jaw, especially for the sides of my nose. It's really handy that it is that shape so then you can run it down the sides of your nose really easily. And um, yeah, I've just really been obsessed with this brush. So I'm a big user of the L'Oreal True Match Foundation, but I had never tried the True Match powder. And I finally picked it up in a sale and I'm obsessed with it. I love using this with my BB cream because my BB cream gives a little bit of coverage and so does this. So it kind of looks more flawless type look with it when I add the powder to it. So I've really been liking this powder. The shade that I picked up is W3, which does match to my foundation and I've just really been liking it for everyday use like for work and stuff where you don't need too much coverage but you do want a little bit because like you know I have oily skin and this has been really good for that so I've really been liking the L'Oreal Too Much powder. I recently ran out of my NARS Casino bronzer and I was looking for something else to replace that. I didn't want to repurchase it again because I wasn't really feeling that shade of bronzer on me anymore. I felt it was looking kind of muddy and it just didn't look as good. So I picked up this just to test out because I was going to buy MAC um, Give Me Sun but I, I saw this in Priceline and I was like I'll just try it. And I have fallen in love with this bronzer. So this is the Models Prefer Soft Touch Mineral Powder in the shade Radiant Bronze. And it's this beautiful, if I can open it. So it's this beautiful bronze shade and I'm absolutely obsessed with it because using this you can't mess up your bronzer. So it doesn't look muddy or heavy or cakey. It actually looks really smooth and natural and it makes your skin look flawless. I absolutely love it. It's great. If you want to pick it up, you can get it from Priceline. I'm not exactly sure how much it costs, but if you can find it, because a couple of stores have been out of stock, I highly recommend for you to purchase it because it is a great bronzer. And my last favorite of the month is this. I'm sure most of you have heard of this. It's been pretty well sought after lately. And it's the Biore Deep Cleansing Charcoal Pore Strips. So my cousin was the one who actually got me onto this. She picked it up and said that I needed to try it because she used it and she said it was amazing. So it's like, okay, I'll go and pick it up. And I love it. It honestly gets everything out. So basically, as you can see in the picture, it's just a pore strip that you apply to your nose, let it sit and then you peel it off and you get to see all the dirt come out of the pores on your nose and I don't know about you guys but there's something really satisfying about taking dirt out of your pores, I don't know. Like I know it's gross but it's kind of awesome to see that much stuff come out of your pores and then it's good to know that you don't have that in there anymore. So I use this like once a week or so and um, I have not stopped using it every week. I love it. You can pick it up from Priceline. They've been having a lot of sales with this brand lately so if you do see a sale, stock up because a lot of the times I do find that they are out of stock. It's pretty popular at the moment and I've really been liking it. Alright guys, those are my current favourites. I hope you enjoyed. Give it a thumbs up if you did and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you aren't already so you can stay updated with all the videos that I post. I love you guys so much and I will see you all in my next video. Take care.